Andrew Churchill here, your student forum president for the second edition of the State of the Union Address. Um, and this is uh, the September 16th edition, and we're going to cover everything from the student forum meeting on September 14th to the class of 2012 special elections, which happened today. I am happy to announce that those election results are back. Um, Eric Langner has won the presidency, Patrick Flanagan the vice presidency, and Jocelyn Vio will be the secretary treasurer of the class of 2012. So congratulations to the new forum members. We're excited to see you at our next meeting on Tuesday. Now at the student forum meeting this Tuesday, we created an ad hoc committee to look at campaigns and elections. So we will be looking at the structure of campaigns um, and how they're run on campus. So look out for changes perhaps to the way that we're running campaigns when the first years have their elections week five. Now I want to thank everyone for coming out to Club Expo. That was a great event. Uh, many clubs were there, 69 clubs and more organizations. And there was a lot of fun stuff and food. So I just want to thank everyone on campus for coming out and making that a great event for everyone. We also looked at the printing cards and printing fees in the library. And Student Forum had a vote of sentiment that passed 1100 to look further into possibly getting reduced or subsidized printing cards for everyone on campus. So if that is a major concern of yours, we would definitely like to hear your voice because that would give us a better idea of if we want to allocate money for printing or allocate it somewhere else. If you have any concerns um, for the any of our VPs, VP of Academics, VP of Campus Life, um, they would really like to hear from you. So VP of Academics is Andrew Davis, VP of, of uh, Campus Life is Melissa Walsh, Patricia Sanchez would also like to hear from you, um, she is the VP of Multicultural Affairs. So if you have any concerns, they are starting their own committee meetings that they are chairing and they would really like to hear your voice so that they know what the salient issues and pressing issues are on campus. In addition, we looked into updating student activities and that is a project that Dan Moldwin is looking into right now. Um, Anthony Perez thought about applying for a green grant to cut down on costs of printing. And Aaron Glosser, who is the new Minerva rep, brought up seeing if we could, you know, update the computer system in there. So if that's an issue that you would like to see happen, um, please get in touch with those members of Forum, and that way your concerns will be voiced. All clubs after Club Expo, try to get in contact with your club members. In addition, through finance, you are all in the process of being trained or need to be trained. So if you have not been trained yet, we have a new treasurer and president's handbook this year, you're going to need to get trained on Friday or Monday. So in order to spend funds, you're going to need to be trained with a member of the finance committee, and that way you can start putting on events. On Tuesday the 21st, 21st at 8 p.m., Student Forum will be teaming up with RAs in all of the first year residence halls and we will be discussing the Good Samaritan policy, the point policy, hard liquor policy. Uh, so we're just trying to make sure that the first years have all the knowledge that they need in order to make good decisions and enjoy themselves properly here at Union during their first year. Uh, we also had another interesting idea come up in Forum and Pat O'Hearn uh, the IFC Council President brought this uh, interesting proposal up and that is to have the head RAs sit on student forum and his rationale was that the RAs are very involved with campus life and could bring a unique perspective to forum so if this is an issue that you would like to see happen please get in touch with Pat. That's going to be pretty much it for this uh, week's edition of State of the Union Address. Uh, again, just to recap, I'm really happy that Club Expo went so well and just 
If you have any concerns, please feel free to talk to me or any of the individuals who I have spoke about here tonight or your class representatives. And again, congratulations to the new one-term class representatives of the class of 2012.